This week in music, we are talking about form, and form is how we organize music. So I want you to take a look at these silly little penguins, and it asks us a question. It says, what's your favorite game in the winter? And so I might ask, what's your favorite thing to do in the winter? Check out these penguins. These penguins are building a snowman. This penguin here has snowballs. Maybe he's getting ready for a snowball fight. We have one that's skiing, one that's snowboarding, one that is sledding down the hill, and then we have two that are ice skating. Our song today is all about ice skating. The name of the song is called The Skater's Waltz. So I want to show you these penguins right here. And in fact, it's not just penguins. Do you see the rabbit? We have penguin, rabbit, penguin. If I take a look at the letters, I see A, B, A. So when we organize our music, we might organize it by sections. And instead of saying section one, two, or three, we give them letters. So I'm going to say section A, B, A. There are two sections in this song, the A section and the B section. Now it's kind of hard to see, but if you take a look at that penguin, there's lines there. We're gonna hear the A section one, two times. Then we get to our rabbit, the B section, and we're gonna hear it one, two, three, four times. Then we end with our A section and we hear it one time. Do you think the A sections are gonna sound the same? They are, that's why they're both letter A. If this one was different, they would give it a different letter. Now it's kind of hard to see, but if you take a look at that rabbit, he has two special instruments, the flute and the triangle. When we hear this song, we're going to hear the flute and triangle during the B section. Let's listen to the skater's waltz and Mrs. Puren will kind of show you where we are with our listening map. He's skating. And there it is the second time through. Did you hear how the music changed? It doesn't sound the same as A, it's B. And if you listen really carefully, you can hear the flute and the triangle. There we go. Here's our last time with our B. So let's listen. Do you hear? That is the same, but we only get to hear it one time. So that song is called The Skater's Waltz, and I have a fun little video that you can click on to watch. These ice skaters are dancing to the skater's waltz. Now it's a little bit longer. You're gonna hear a few other sections, but I really like to watch these ice skaters because they do some pretty neat moves. And we can be our own ice skaters as well. So watch the other video and Mrs. Pierre will show you how you can be an ice skater.